Kelly Lewis from Geek Brief TV. Come over here, I wanna show you a friend of mine. This is Jerobo. It's a storage robot. And I'm really excited about this because I do a lot of video and I have a lot of data, so I need a lot of storage. So this thing is amazing. I'm here with Tom. Hi there. <laughs> so let's talk about this. Let's show everybody how it works. Sure. This is a magnetic cover, yes? Absolutely. And it just flips right off. So tell me what's inside. So the Drobo is basically just a big hard drive enclosure that can take up to four hard drives and it pulls them together and keeps your data safe and it's always expandable. And it really, the key is it doesn't require any user interaction or anything complicated. It's as simple as can be. Okay, and so we have three lights basically with Drobo, right? Green, yellow, red. That's right, just like the stoplight. Right. <laughs> so green means go, your data safe. Yellow is a warning and talk about that. So yellow is basically telling you, well, we have the instructions actually right here on the back cover of the, of the front plate. But yellow basically means add a drive, you're running out of capacity. And red means one of your hard drive has failed. And blinking red means you're running out of room really critically. Okay, and it's redundant like RAID, but it is smarter than RAID, right? That's right. We set out when we designed Drobo to account for a lot of the deficiencies in RAID, which basically means it's too complicated for your typical prosumer or home user or small business without an IT staff. So Drobo doesn't have any of the typical limitations or rigidities associated with RAID. So I can buy any hard drives I want, any make, any side, pop them right in there. I can put them in different order. There's just all these benefits that we have over RAID. So it's much, much simpler for, for the consumer to use. Uh, basically, all they have to do is put drives in and pay attention to the lights. So when they need to replace a drive, they put one in. Uh, and when one fails, they replace it. So let's, uh, you want to simulate a hard drive failure? Absolutely. That's the most fun part. That is the most fun. You know what? It, it's only fun when you can do something dangerous and you know that it's not going to destroy anything. <laughs> that's right. I sleep better at night knowing I have all my data on a Drobo. All right, so let's do that. You're just going to pop out a drive and hot swap? Sure. So on a screen behind us, we've got a, a video playing directly from the Drobo. And this is simulating a typical experience that a user may have, um, keeping their videos or iTunes music or something like that on their Drobo. So I'm just going to pick any drive. It doesn't matter which one. I'll take maybe this one right here. And I'm just going to eject it. And that's simulating what would happen if a hard drive crashes. And you know, as, as you said on your show, these hard drives are mechanical devices. They tend to fail on average every three or four years. So this is something that you shouldn't be surprised if happens. And our video is still playing, never skipped a beat, and your data's safe. That is so cool. And these green and yellow lights mean what? So the, the Drobo is what we call data aware. So it, it well, it's not self-conscious or anything like that. It's, it's pretty close. Can it talk to us and think for us? Hopefully next year at Macworld. I'm just kidding. But we, we do have uh, some lights on here. These tell you about the status of your drives. So this is telling you Drobo's doing something right now. It's relaying out your data in the most efficient and safe way possible so that your data is always protected. The lights on the bottom tell you how much free capacity you've got left. And this is completely unique to Drobo. You won't find this on any other product on the market today. And how expandable is it? It's infinitely expandable. Right now, it theoretically takes up to 16 terabytes of storage, which is obviously a lot in a small footprint. But today, unfortunately, you can only buy one terabyte drives. So you can pop in one terabyte drives, fill this up, and have up to three terabytes of protected capacity today. You announced a new product uh, Monday, right? That's right. Called Share? Yep, it's called Drobo Share, and I don't have one in front of me right oh, no, now. No, it's not on this demo. <laughs> it's on over there. But Drobo Share is basically just a little companion to Drobo that sends underneath it and lets you attach up to two Drobos uh, to your network by gigabit Ethernet. And it's really fast and easy to use, and there's no configuration required. You just plug it in, and it automatically mounts in both Windows and uh, OS X. Awesome. Thank you so much. You're welcome. I'm Callie Lewis. Bandwidth for MacBreak is provided by Cashfly at C A C H E F L Y dot com.